There's a little sneak peek. <laughs> That's all you get. It is absolutely gorgeous outside. It's Friday. Good morning, guys. It is the start of a, another week, and I decided I'm going to do a little like mini weekly vlog for you guys. I'm just going to be filming it on my phone, so it's going to be very casual, but I have quite a few things that I need to do this week and I figured it would be interesting as a way to like kind of come back and update you like what my life looks like right now as a person who is working a job, someone who's doing content creation for a job, and a travel agent as a job. So I'm working a lot but it's two of the things are more fun hobbyist things on this week's agenda i need to film a couple of videos for the week i need to make a couple of tiktoks slash instagram reels and then we're also in the middle of a bedroom renovation not really a renovation like a just a refresh we are painting so i'm also doing that as well so if you are interested in any of those things, then just keep on watching. So this package should be a clothing bag. It's pretty tiny, so I'm a little bit worried, but I'm going to open it up and put it together today because this will make outfits so much easier. So this is what the rack is going to look like. I will leave this linked um in the links down below because this was super affordable it was under $30 I think it was $28 and it came in like two days <laughs> so I'm gonna start putting this together and I'll probably do it on a time lapse because this is gonna take a bit so far this is fairly easy I always recommend <laughs> Anytime you're putting something together from Amazon, just read through the whole directions first because they don't really specify very well like what directions things should be facing. So now that I have the rack up and built, I'm going to put some things on it. I'm planning some outfits for a Animal Kingdom outfits video for their 25th anniversary. So the reason I really wanted this rack in particular was the price point and because it had these little hooks that I thought would be perfect for lounge flies or ears or fanny packs, just like a place to put accessories because I don't have good places to store my lounge fly and I hate just like putting them in my closet because I don't want them to get squished or ruined so I'm gonna pull some outfits give you a little sneak peek of some stuff you can look forward to later this month so here's a little sneak peek of some of the outfits I put together. So my first step is just pulling things and putting them together. Then I try them on, figure out what accessories I want to put with them, and then I will um, iron them, wash them, or uh, throw them in the dryer, whatever they need to be before I take video of them. So I just got done filming a little clothing haul. Here's a little sneak peek. <laughs> That's all you get um, for my channel. Um, now I have to do some laundry and put all of these clothes away. I did switch over my clothes, sort of. I took out all of my spring stuff, so I have to put that stuff away in my closet. 
and I still have some like sweaters and winter pieces that I'm gonna put away so I can show you guys how I store those because I don't have a huge amount of storage for clothing um me and my husband share the closet and this little armoire thing right there and then a really tiny dresser so between the two of us um there's not that much space for clothes. So this is the perfect time to put this stuff away because I'm literally right here. This stuff is specifically stuff for like Disney vacations or like any kind of warm weather vacations. So I love these little containers. I have two of them i have one on either side of my bed and they fit super nice underneath the bed i got them from target and they were really inexpensive and they hold quite a bit they're fairly thin but summer like spring clothes if that's what you're using them for are really easy to pack like i have a million tank tops like just right here and it fits with room to spare so i'm gonna put these things in here Dove learns to fly away Like the moon shining all its way Down to the earth Oh, what is it worth? I'm awaiting your guidance I'm ready for your lead Please can you tell me Who, what, when, when to be But don't think with emotion Leave the logic out so these are the space bags that I use. They're a lot bigger than the other ones. I get the jumbo size because it just makes the most sense for me. They're by the brand Space Saver. I got them on Amazon, so I'll leave them linked down below. They were very affordable. And I have a couple more clothing pieces I'm adding to this one. And I just vacuum them and stick them under my bed. And it's super easy. Ride your instincts, I will follow you through this summer sweet melody. We all sing in harmony, stomp our feet to the sound of the beat. I can't ignore the summer sweet. And I can fit two of these stacked under my bed um, on this side and then two on the other side. So that takes care of all mine and my husband's winter stuff during the summer and the spring and then our summer spring stuff during the fall and the winter oh i just got home from work and it is absolutely gorgeous outside like i'm actually sweating in my car right now um it is the first nice nice day that we've had in weeks so i'm gonna go for a walk because it's still light out and i really wanted to get some like outdoor time in today is trim painting and sanding day i'm gonna try and get one coat on before i have to go to work and i'm gonna have to shower after because i'm gross <laughs> But I'm going to try and do one coat of paint so I can kind of see what it's going to look like. This is where we're at. I painted the window trim here, as you can see, and the baseboard trim. Started on the door. The door itself will be painted as well, but I'm just kind of trying to do the trim first because that's a priority. And as you can see, the room is kind of in disarray. So hey guys, it is Thursday around 5.30, probably closer to 5.40 now. And I just got back home from work, hence my disheveled appearance. But I got two packages that I've been waiting for for a while and I just wanted to open them and this will be kind of all that I include for Thursday. 
I ordered two pairs of Converse and I have been waiting on like a year to order these because last year I saw them and loved them and really wanted to get a pair but I told myself to wait because I wasn't sure if they were going to be too trendy or not but they still are popular now and I still really like them. So I used my birthday coupon. If you don't know, Converse gives you 20% off if you sign up and like enter when your birthday is. Um, like a week or so before your birthday, they'll send you 20% off. So I used that on these and then I also had some like honey cash back. I had like $15 in cash back. So I used that plus earned more cash back. So. <laughs> I love a good deal. Let me move this giant box out of the way. So yeah, I did order two pairs of Converse. I'm super excited because I have owned like Converse in the past, but they're not the most comfortable shoe. But these particular Converse I have tried on in person and they are the platforms. The platform makes all the difference in the world because I find that that's the biggest problem with Converse is that the bottom is so thin you can just like feel every rock and bump in the road but the platform makes them so much more comfortable and even the sole itself is just a lot more cushioned. So I got the white platform Converse. I'm so excited to wear these. And I am going to be taking these to Disney with me. I'm going to try and break them in before my trip. I have quite a bit of time still. So I'm really excited. But these are not just a Disney shoe. These are like my birthday present to myself. And then I also got the black pair. Now these are the... They're slightly different. These are like the move version. Um, what is the exact name? Yeah, I think they're just called Converse Move High Tops. So you can kind of see the difference. These are even more comfortable. So I think I'm gonna bring both of these on my trip and kind of wear these towards the end when I need a little bit more support. Both of them, super comfortable, super squishy, and I'm just really excited. These are just a classic shoe, and I went for black and white because that'll go with everything. It's Friday, and I'm off today. I'm getting a late start today, though it's around 10 o'clock, and my room is a disaster. It's not too bad. It's just disheveled. We had our heating and air conditioning ducts cleaned out this morning, so I had to like sh move everything around in my bedroom and I just they just left, so now I can kind of get started and do everything that I had planned for today. I had planned on filming some YouTube videos, but I don't have enough time to get those done. So I think I'm just going to film some short form content for TikTok and Instagram instead and kind of just see what I feel like doing. I am off Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday this next week because it's my spring break. So I'm going to do like a lot of filming that week. So first things first, let's get, I'm gonna get ready, do some like light makeup, get dressed, and clean up my room a little bit. I may do that in the reverse order though. Yeah, I think I'm gonna clean up my room first. So I'll just do a little time lapse for you guys. Put everything back together, make the bed, get ready for the day. Stomp our feet to the sound of the feet. I can in your bed. Struggling for 
are lying Spreading our disease and never giving up the fight Until it finds what it's been looking for Like the morning light illuminates the sky Allowing us once again to use our sight Open up your eyes and see But don't think with emotion Leave the logic out this time Ride your instincts, I will follow you Through this summer sweet Alright, so now I'm filming some content. I'm doing outfits on Instagram, TikTok, and YouTube. I'm filming my like travel planning outfits a little bit. I can't finish it today, but since I'm filming these outfits for TikTok anyways, I'm gonna film them for YouTube as well. I like to do like multi-content days where I don't have to do double the work. If I'm gonna be filming outfits, I'll take pictures of them for Instagram or something. So it just makes everything easier because I can get content on my phone and my camera at the same time. And I'm just kind of pulling out some stuff, some accessories, and I already did one outfit. I did this outfit with the glove ears. So if you want to see any of these outfits, they will be posted on my TikTok in like short form, just quick little snippets of them. If you want to see my entire process for outfit planning, that's going to be here on YouTube. So this is where I'm going to end off today. I was hoping to get more done, but we were having something done on the house, so that kind of messed things up, but that's okay. Still got a good amount done. So I'm going to end this vlog here because I don't intend to film on the weekends. I don't work at all on the weekends. That is something that I make a priority because if you do content creation or any kind of like online work, I feel like it's really easy to fall into that trap of just working non-stop. So Saturday and Sunday are my days off. I have things auto-scheduled on Saturday and Sunday I don't post anything. So I hope you guys enjoyed this weekly vlog. Let me know if you would like to see more of these in the future. I can definitely do them. They're kind of sporadic because my work schedule is sporadic, but I had a really good time taking you along with me through my week and this is pretty much what a week looks like for me so if you guys did enjoy make sure to hit that subscribe button and give this video a like and i'll see you guys in my next video